Hey y'all, I've got another awesome guest for you. Pam here is gonna talk to us about what she likes to call feeding around. Feeding around is basically sleeping around, but you get to eat. Um, thanks for taking the time. No, normally I wouldn't, but since this is a topic so close to my cold, dead heart, I couldn't refuse. Mm. What do you wanna know? Um, I guess let's start out with why. Why? It feels good. Oh, I mean, well, of course it feels good, but is that the only reason that, that you do it? Yeah, it's empowering to satisfy your desires, to divide and conquer, to own a human's blood. And especially for you young ones out there, it's a quick way to learn, to stretch your vampire muscles, so to speak. Some get off to a rocky start and accidentally kill truckers, and then have no clue how to dispose of the body. We wouldn't want that to happen to any of you now, would we? Um, I've heard a little bit about uh, safe feeding, but when I try to Google it, I can't ever find a straight answer. Uh, maybe you can explain? Well, the main thing to watch out for is Hep D. It can weaken you a lot. It's not too common, but it's out there. Well, so how do you protect yourself? Can't. Other than to stay away from those humans. You look for dark circles under the eyes, lethargy, they're, and their blood tastes it's slightly metallic. It's hard to tell, actually, so be careful when you're picking your meal. GTK. Oh, that's uh, good to know. Uh, what about the emotional part? Any, any words of wisdom for, for us more sensitive types? This is something I'll never personally understand. You have to see it this way. It's in your nature, and you can't fight nature. It's only a matter of time before you give yourself over to it, so why waste energy wrestling the inevitable? I guess we're not as far from our humanity. Humans aren't just food to us. I mean, only a few years ago I was a warm-blooded Hamby, you know, going to church barbecues and abortion clinic protests, and it can be hard to let that go. It, it, it takes time. Well, you're getting there, making slow but steady progress. I am? Yeah, look at you already, a recovering monogamist. Hmm. <laughs> Next topic, toots. Um... Oh, um, initiation. I usually, I usually let them come to me. Oh, no, 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 no. Where is the fun in that? I like to eye fuck them. Give them all sorts of mixed signals. Then I'll slowly waltz up, maybe bat my eyelashes or flash a sassy smile. Then I'll tell them exactly what I want to do and how I'm going to do it. Works every time. Okay, come on. That's enough chat room fun. Let's go procuring. What are you in the mood for? Black, white, male, female. Oh. How about another fire crotch? That might be cute. 